Hello, in this video today we are going to see how a varistor really blows up. So here I have a Fordin D471 standard varistor which is rated for 470 volts peak and we have two multimeters. In this multimeter we are measuring the AC voltage through RMS and in this multimeter we are measuring the AC current. So um, let's start our auto transformer and increase the voltage bit by bit slowly. So currently as you can see we have 1.6 voltage and no current getting consumed by the varistor. Let's ramp it up to 250 volts AC. Now we are at 250 volts. As you can see nothing happens to the varistor. Now keep the voltage ramping up to something like 350. And you can see that pretty much nothing happens. Now we are keeping it up to 400 volts. A little bit more than that. Now something happens. And as you can see, we are consuming 1.3 amps and it is getting very hot. And it is making crackling noise. Let me focus the camera. And it is blowing up like that. And if I measure the temperature, it is still on. And if I measure the temperature, it is very, very hot. It shows around 280 degrees. around 260 280 something like that so that's very hot right so that's how it blows up it is still on and still burning so as you can see that it is clamping the AC voltage to 14 volts so our devices are protected and that's how varistar works and protects our device this smoke is not that good I'm going to turn on my air purifier, so be careful not to play around with these poisonous things. So yeah, that's it. Um, in the next video, we are going to blow up a TVS diode.